Jefferson County is close to having a warming center for the homeless population as winter nears. The county has formed a homeless steering committee, which is working with a handful of local nonprofits. The goal here is choosing a site that will be open from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. when the temperatures get below freezing. County Administrator Bob Hageman is pretty sure the location is set, but won't release the details until everything is settled. Those in the details, those are still being worked on, but there is a, a site that is uh, primarily being identified, likely on a shorter term basis, meaning this year, whether it goes beyond this year at that location or not remains to be seen. So as the county moves forward with a warming center, another new nonprofit wants to tackle the homeless issue on its own. Leaders don't have complete confidence the county's approach will work. With that other pr approach, your Seven News reporter Zach Grady. A more holistic way to help the homeless and a new idea from a nonprofit. The Watertown Area Rescue Mission, or WARM, formed after a fire ruined the Rainbow Motel and 661 Factory Street was condemned. Leaders hope to address the homeless problem with a bigger picture approach. Through working through the program, they can reintegrate back into the community with their skills. They can learn how to develop healthy relationships um, and really build a foundation that they can grow from. Pushback from residents and elected officials caused the nonprofit to stop plans to buy this North Pleasant Street property. Now it's looking at land off of Coffeen Street to build something new. Homeless shelters and warming centers can be an area where crime occurs or violence occurs. So there needs to be um, there needs to be an approach to the structure that provides safety and security. Warm hopes its proposal can be more than just a warming center. Thank you, Along with the main welcome. building, it hopes to provide private rooms, showers, and food, as well maybe even help find people jobs. This program we hope to be a pilot for other programs that can be implemented across the state or across the country. Lego is prepared for more pushback, but Warm feels strongly in doing something and doing something safely. Lego is hoping to work with other community groups to have a solution before colder weather sets in. Zach Grady, 7 News.